Dear Diary, August 12th. Moved into our new home in Pennsylvania. It is so beautiful here. The hills and river valleys are so picturesque. I have a beautiful pine tree in my front yard and a magnificent oak tree standing tall with a winding creek that flows in the backyard. This is truly God's country. October 14th. Pennsylvania is such a gorgeous place to live, one of the real special places on earth. The leaves are turning in a multitude of different colors. I love all of the shades of reds, oranges, and yellows. They are so bright. I want to walk through all the beautiful hills and spot some white-tailed deer. They are so graceful. Surely they must be the most peaceful creatures on earth. This must be paradise. November 11th. Deer season opens this week. I can't imagine why anyone would want to shoot these elegant animals. They are the very symbol of peace and tranquility here in Pennsylvania. I hope it snows soon. I love it here. December 2nd, it snowed last night. I woke to the usual wonderful sight, everything covered in a beautiful blanket of white. The pine tree is magnificent. It looks like a postcard. We went out and swept the snow from the steps and driveway. You have everything your heart desires. You have everything your heart desires. You have everything your heart desires. The air is so crisp clean and refreshing. We had a snowball fight. I won. And the snow plow came down the street. He must have gotten too close to the driveway because we had to go out and shovel the end of the driveway again. What a beautiful place, nature in harmony. I love it here. December 12th. More snow last night. I love it. The plow did his cute little trick again. What a rascal. A winter wonderland. I love it here. December 19th. More snow. Couldn't get out of the driveway to get to work in time. I'm exhausted from all the shoveling and that snow plow. December 21st. More of that white shit coming down. I got blisters on my hands and a kink in my back. I think that's the snow plow driver waits around the corner until I'm done shoveling the driveway, jackass. December 25th. White Christmas? More freaking snow. If I ever get my hands on that son of a bitch who drives that snowplow, I swear I'll castrate him. And why don't they use more salt on these roads to melt this crap? December 28th. It hasn't stopped snowing since Christmas. I've been inside since then. Except, of course, when that SOB snowplow Harry comes by. Can't go anywhere. Cars are buried up to the windows. Weatherman says to expect another 10 inches. Do you have any idea how many shovelfuls 10 inches is? January 1st. Happy New Year. 
The way it's coming down, it won't melt until the 4th of July. The snow plow got stuck down the road, and that rotten idiot actually had the nerve to come and ask to borrow my shovel. I told him I'd broken six already this season. January 27th. It warmed up a little and rained today. The rain turned the snow into ice, and the weight of it broke the main limb of the oak tree in the back and through the roof. I should have cut that old piece of shit into fireplace wood when I had the chance. The creek no longer flows. The damn thing is frozen solid. The beautiful blanket of white soon turned black. May 10th. I sold the car, the house, and moved to Florida. I can't imagine why anyone in their freaking mind would ever want to live in the godforsaken state of Pennsylvania. <laughs>